Hey everybody, it's Zarazar here. We are back to play a little bit more Stardew Valley. Uh, it's raining out today. What's a rerun of the Queen? Is this the stir fry? Yeah. Alright. I know how to cook stir fry. So with the Queen of Sauce, sometimes you'll see rerun. Um, still click them because it, rerun only means that it's played before. It doesn't mean that you watched it before. So. Alright, so we don't have to plant anything today, but there is our potato and here is our parsnip for the spring bundle. And it's a Wednesday, and see, this is why I bought those potato seeds, because we can't go buy seeds today, but look, bam, bam, we're good to go. I should buy some more potato seeds, actually, because I only have, like, three seeds, and can you imagine if all these parsnips went on a Wednesday? I would be so mad. Alright, so we can do the spring bundle. Um, I'll grab a couple of the other things I know that I'm holding on to for, like, the fish bundles. Bum, bum, ba -dum. Just because that's the only space that I have. Actually, we can just come back here after, I guess. So, we can take some of the other bundly things, I think, and then we'll just come back and get... We may fish. We're not going to water and can today. We're probably not going to mine. I do need a daffodil. We're not going to use the hoe today. We're not going to use the scythe today. Alright, so we can still bring that. And... Here, let's put that in for the... Bundle. Alright, we'll go bundling, then we'll go find Vincent and give him his daffodil, uh, which I didn't actually look. So let's just make sure I'm not losing my tiny mind about about Buddy here. Vincent Towns people likes daffodils. Good. But he doesn't like vegetables, which is kind of funny just because of him being like a, a kid late, right? It's like, yeah, he wouldn't. Um, what does he do in the rain on a spring? He has to get his shots. Oh no, spring 11. This is raining. Okay. Plays inside his home. Moves around inside his home. Moves inside his home. Okay, so I have to go into his house apparently. <laughs> Alright. He wakes up at 9 though, so we're gonna do the bundles first. Some of the bundles anyway. Um. It's really good when you're mining if you can get a crab because in the crab pot bundle which requires quite a few items one of the ones you can use is the crab and so we have one of the oh I already brought it look at that so you can actually get a crab you can actually pick them up nothing else of this you can forge I actually don't know where to get a shrimp the lobster the crayfish they all come from the um, crab pots and the snail and the periwinkle I don't think you can ever like these are the only four that you get on the beach but you can occasionally find a crab in the mines, and that really helps. So, oh, let's click on the same one. River fish bundle? No, I do have some fish for that one, but, but no. Why would I even click on the specialist? It's not an ocean fish. Lake fish? Is that a smallmouth? Was. Oh, wow. I Literally, smallmouth isn't one of the ones that you need for the bundles. I'm really just bad. Like, ultra bad. Alright. Good talk. We'll go put some of the spring crops in. Oh, it bugs me because when I come back, this will have moved here. And I'm like, it's out of order. It's not okay. All right, let's head into town, see if there's any quests we can do. Go from there. I wonder if we can sell the. F All right, he's closed anyway. I was like, oh, maybe we can sell the fish to the grocer. Well, that's not gonna work. It's closed. Pierre's is closed on Wednesdays. All right. Still not. Um. Actually, you know what's a good idea when it's raining is to see if there's any fish that you catch for the um bundles that are uh like rain specific for the season that you're in. Because sometimes it's like. Oh, you know, you can only get them for, um, you know, if springing in the rain. And if it's springing in the rain, like, okay, shad found in rivers. Spring, summer, and fall only when raining. So it's not a bad idea to try to look for a shad. Um, anytime, anytime. Only when raining in the ocean, summer, and fall. Um, only when raining, fall. Eel, which is just, I'm not going to be able to catch yet. The crab pot, yeah. Okay, so we can try to catch a sh I think I actually, maybe I have a shad in my inventory. So maybe that's, like, nothing. Alright, well, let's go to the beach then. 
Maybe there's a fishing spot on the beach. The rain, I don't know if it does anything for fishing. I really don't. But we can sell a little small mouse since it turns out we didn't need it. We can sell this too since it turns out we don't need it because we already have one for the bundle. Assuming Willie's in there. And then we can come back, do the birthday daffodil. Goes with the breakfast parsnip from last episode. No, two episodes ago. And yeah. What's up, Will? Sell. Sell. That's what I already have, right? Um, oh. thanks. Um, actually, I guess we should go mining now? After we do this? Because we don't have anything else to do today. But I can go back. That's what I really should be doing, as I'll just be like, oh, well, I'll go mining. But I need, like, I need, like, a specialized mining, um, what's the word that I want? box so that anytime I decide to go mining I just like get rid of everything in my inventory and pick up a couple of mining things you know but I never do that all right all right Vincent I'm just gonna walk right by go mining and forget about his birthday the poor little kid okay I think the big house is theirs like I think this one is Emily and Haley's and this one is Vincent's yep yeah. uh he's in here somewhere where is he oh there he is it's your birthday You get a daffodil. Good. Talk to everybody else. I, um... Only 11. I, um... Push the kid. Yeah. Um... Rain. Rains are cool. Two heart... Wow. Can I do a two heart event? No. Does he have a two heart? Probably not. Two heart events are usually only for uh, the ones that are, that you can like, <laughs> I was going to say mate with. That's not okay. Oh yeah, he's an eight heart event. Holy jump. All right, we're never going to get to eight hearts with him. And there's no advantage whatsoever for him to, to have any hearts with him. It was a colossal waste of my time. Cool. Let's go mining. Pop OBS up so I can check how long I've been doing this stuff. You probably mine quite a bit today, um, especially if we can find any forage on the way. What does it feel? Acorn, maple seed, pine cone. That's the thing. That's the only advantage to like keeping that stuff. I always get rid of them because I'm like, whatever. But then you can make the field snacks. And it really is worth it. I hate to admit it. Yeah, I need like a... Okay, I'm going to take these out. This is the stuff I always have with me, right? Nothing else in here is going to really help me mine. So, is that a shad? I think that's a shad. Yeah, so I don't have to worry about the... Okay, let's... What do we need for a box? We need 50 wood. Do I even have 50 wood? Yes, but... Let's get 50 wood instead, because then I can do this plan where I want the stuff. Good talk. The um, field snacks. Just need to kill all three kinds of trees, and then you can make the field snacks. Need acorns, maple seeds, something else. Now that I've like said that I need them, they're like, nope. Is it just one of each? I didn't even notice. It doesn't sound very tasty, does it? Mm, you know what I really have a hankering for? An acorn and maple seed and a pine cone mixed together. Not appealing to me. I know that when you chop things down near the water, sometimes it makes like a sound as if stuff falls in the water. I don't know if it actually does though. I'm not really clear on that. 
Maybe it does though, because I like instinctually, after playing this game 5,000 times, do not want to chop like this tree down here, you know what I mean? So. Wow. I was there like, oh, you just cut down trees and then you can get the stuff for the field snacks. And I am apparently a giant liar. And I don't have the energy to mine now. We can mine tomorrow. This is taking a lot of energy. I I cannot get what a liar this is making out of me. Worth a try. Oops. Oh, okay. Oh well. Good talk. Those are my three tapping trees, if you know what I mean. But alright, I'm gonna save I'm gonna make a mining box, you know what I mean. You are for mining things. I wonder if I just put No. Like stuff that I would get mining in it too, right? That would make sense. That's not incredibly illogical. That's that's quite reasonable. Uh, yeah. No, it does. It, okay, so I'm gonna put you and you and you and you. Well, I could still use the pickaxe. The sword I really don't need unless I'm mining. Um, things that I only need while mining, you know. So. Things that you get while mining. So that it's just like one stop, you know what I mean? Like I can just be like bloop 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 and it's all together. First off, we need you to be a miney color. Put you guys in there. Okay. So now, those are the ones that I have out. And then when I'm mining, I'll swap to... Um, I mean, the hoe's good for the cave carrot, but I'll just, find, I'll just find a cave carrot if I need it. But I'll put the hoe away. I'll put the axe away. The scythe I thought was good for something in the mines, but I might be losing it. I think you can use the sword and the scythe almost like interchangeably for stuff in the mines. So, all right, let's go to bed. Good talk. Boop, boop, boop. Survival burger. Cooking recipe though, right? It wasn't a crafting recipe? You a cooking recipe or crafting recipe? I think you were a cooking recipe. Yeah. Alright. That sunshine streaming in. Let's see what our tip is today. Scarecrow. Okay. And get a bigger backpack. I'm working on it. Are you telling me about the... Oh yeah, the axe. Alright. We can do that. Oops. Right, expansion for the home. That's what we need for cooking in the first place. Water some plants. Alright, so we can put that green bean in the bundle. And then we just wait for one of these cauliflowers to grow, which I really don't have that many of them because they're so expensive and it takes a while to have enough money to really like go nuts with the cauliflower. Like, you can do it pretty easily when you're on multiplayer when you're sharing an account. Well, right now you have to share an account, but when the update comes out, you won't. All right, I'm gonna drop that in the bundle. Um, actually, let's go find the axe first. Then we'll drop that in the bundle. Then we'll find the axe, drop it on the bundle, come back to the farm. Still have the axe, grab our mining stuff, head up there. Give it to Robin, head to the mine. Thunder day. Cool. That's what we're gonna do. Don't know if any of you really follow that because, you know, why would you? But, let's see if I can find Marnie. Talk to her. Oh, that's why. Right, so we'll go get the axe. Then we'll come back. Something to snack on while we mine. Oh, there's nothing. Okay. Just sad. Oopsie. Can I eat this dandelion? 
Yes. And it's much better. Maybe I will keep the horseradish to give to Mountain Dude. And then I will keep the dandelion to eat. When we are mining. Give myself a little bit more energy. 25 versus 13. So yeah, it's enough to make it worth my while, so to speak. We'll never ever do that again. Alright, we're gonna just go say hi to Marnie. Because eventually you want to be her friend. So while I'm walking by, I might as well just talk to her every single time. Yes, I will talk I will treat animals with respect, don't you worry. I'm just gonna look at Marnie. See what she's into. Alright. Oh, she's into Oh, she's into quartz. Sorry, I can bring her quartz. Doom, 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 boom. Okay. Now we have this little moment where the kids are playing in the sewer. They see something. And they freak out. Alright, anyway, they look down, they see something, they're like, ah, and I'm pretty sure it's the dwarf. Spoilers! Anyway. Uh, <laughs> um, so yeah. Okay. Good talk. And by good talk, I mean me humming into the microphone. Okay, I'll do this. Head to the mines. Give back the axe. Ooh, Dapo Didio. Have any purpose? Zero energy. Hmm. Makes a nice gift for a lot of people, but not everybody. Not everybody's into the Dapo Didio. Alright. Uh, spring. See, it moved from here to here. It makes me so mad. Ugh. Gross. It's out of order. Not okay not even a bit hello little junimo they're very cute like i'm very down for a little junimo oh yeah i wanted to just scythe these guys and see if i get any seeds for the summer which is far away but you gotta think about this being canadian i know all about summer being way too effing far away okay we have lots of daffodils so i don't care anymore <laughs> daffodil right there all right and another daffodil. Like, they're just so prevalent. It's just unnecessary. Alright. So, first off, I was at the fodder and the clay and the wild mix seeds, whatever they're called. We give that to Buddy Boy. We give that to Buddy Boy. We're gonna keep that to eat. We're not gonna be fishing in there. I don't think we're gonna get to that level. And I can always come back. Don't need the hoe. We don't need the watering can. We don't need the scythe. We don't need the axe. We need this, this, and those. That's it. That's all we need to do this. Give the axe back. Have a little snack. If there's any leaks. I know that Buddy likes them, but they're actually- Yep, that's what I said. Um, I know that Buddy likes them, but they are also a really good source of energy, so. What just happened there? <laughs> I was looking kind of like off to the side and I just noticed all of that business. Oh, Mountain Man's down there. Right. We'll give this to her, but we'll come back and give Mountain Man a- Oh, a horseradish. Okay, we'll go from there. Oh, I'm so close to being able to afford the backpack upgrade. Which will be so good! For some reason I thought you were just- no? I was just meaning to talk to you. That's fine. Cool! Another one done. Get this cash money. Oh, so close. Alright. Now we'll give Buddy Boy a horseradish. Ooh, fishing spot. I probably can't reach it. 
I don't have my fishing rod. Right. Not the whole point. Alright. <laughs> Good talk. Now we go. A little bit of time. Put on level 10. And pull out our sword. Let's see what the situation is. Grab this quartz. Oh look, way down. Ugh, I hate those things. Uh, I guess I can start collecting bug meat now because I did better things with my inventory. Cute. Cute. And um, we'll grab that copper. Oh, that's what I have the thing for is because I can still... Oh, no. Oh. Copper. Cool. And head down. <laughs> Very glad you can do that, by the way. Ugh, I have to... Rally you out of them bars. <laughs> oh, you leapt at me, jerk. I gotta kill the ten slimes, so that's the Why am I bad at this game? <laughs> Why am I bad at all games? Yeah, I'm big on the just mad click at them thing. It's my way of uh, playing Minecraft as well. Uh, much to the chagrin of the people I play with. Namely, most recently. Um, ooh, okay. Is there anything down here, though? Is there coal in here for me? Oh, it's coal for me. Yeah, remember that. These little minecarts are full of coal. Down we go. Can I, like, take this? Oh, I can! Cool! Oh god. Ah! Ah! <laughs> I can't find my sword! Ultra bad. Ugh. Wow. That's me, the ultra baddie. Ow! Oh no! I don't have the health for this! Ah! Eh, 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 eh. Ugh. Alright, let's eat this daffodil. Dandelion, whatever it is. Don't eat the daffodil. Oh, that was kind of negligible, but whatever. Alright. Are I collecting stuff? I don't believe you ever get the, um,. Stairs from a copper. Pretty sure you only ever get them from. Oh. Nothing else will. Nope. Yeah, like I don't think you ever get um, the stairs from a copper. <laughs> <laughs> Why am I trying to further explain that? Um, you have to dig in like the actual rocks. Alright, this will get us down to 15, which is a good start. I'm just seeing if there's anything really interesting or, you know, that kind of thing, stuff that I really need. Cool, level 15. Ding! Alright. The mines, do five levels at a time. You don't really have to make a big production of the mines. Um, just kind of frequently do five levels, and in no time, you're like way down the mines. It's actually, it works quite well. Alright. Alright, I'll go and kind of call it, I think, um, just kind of deposit all this stuff and uh, kind of go from there. I don't really see a whole lot of point. 
and extending this day a whole lot longer. So yeah, we'll just toss this stuff away. Nope. Keep that. Quartz, earth crystal, slime. Those two go in the other one, those go in the other one, those go in the other one. Okay. Resources. Um, actually, I mean, the bug stuff's like, I'll put that in there, and then when I turn it into bait, I'll put it in the resources one. Um, we'll put you away and grab out. Guys. And maybe just our Q. One copper bar in to smelt. There we go. That'll do her. So thank you so much for joining me for another episode of Stardew Valley. This has been uh, this has been your captain speaking. No, this has been Arzar. And woo, now I'm stretching the bill by own name. Oh my gosh, this has been Arzar. Thank you so much for joining me. We will see you back for the next episode. And yeah, bye.